You know WhatsApp bought this new feature where you can delete messages. That doesn't look new, but actually you can delete the sent messages on both the ends. Meaning that if you sent a message to someone and if you delete the same message on your end, the message will get deleted on the other end as well. Now that looks interesting. That seems like a new feature. But hold on, don't completely rely upon this feature and don't send your enemies hateful texts thinking that you can delete them later because they can read these deleted messages and it just takes some technical knowledge to do so. In this video, I'm going to talk all about that. So let's get started. WhatsApp does all it can to preserve this feature, but here is how it works. When someone sends you a text or a message in WhatsApp, you're going to get a notification on your device, like I got here. And if you're using an Android device, these notifications are actually saved in a notification log. So even though these messages are deleted later, you will still be able to read them because they're actually saved in a notification log. So you can read these messages by simply opening the notification log. You can make use of the notification log widget on your device or simply use this third party application named as notification history. So just search for it on play store, install the app and open it. As soon as you open it, you will see a pop up like this where it says enable system settings. So enable all the required settings by tapping on them. And now you are done setting up the app. Now let me send a WhatsApp message from my other phone to test this. Now as you can see I got a notification that someone sent me a text on WhatsApp. Now this notification is actually saved in my notification log. Let me switch back to my old phone and let me delete this message which I have sent. There we go, the message is deleted. And it says here the message was deleted. Now let's go ahead and check our notification log to see if the message is saved. Open the app and you will see something like WhatsApp. So just tap on it and you will see all the notifications which are saved from WhatsApp. So the first one here is as you can see the message which is deleted. And clearly you are able to read that message which is deleted and you can even copy that to clipboard. Also note that this doesn't work to recover media files and one limitation is that you can only recover messages which are not more than 100 characters. Hit the subscribe button for more videos. Like my Facebook page at facebook.com slash techroj156. Follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash techroj156. Visit my website at techroj156.com. Thanks for watching. Cheers. If you are watching this on your mobile, Click on the bell symbol and you will be notified every time I upload a new video.